Well, we're having our first look today at the latest from Amazon. It's the new Amazon Echo Show 10 with the larger screen. And this thing's got a bunch of cool things built into it. Let's check it out. Well, we started with unboxing uh, this. And as always, uh, taking anything out of uh, an Amazon box is always a treat and pretty easy to do. The nice thing about this is that all the materials inside and the box, the packing stuff, it's all recyclable. So I uh, appreciate that. And uh, again, it's pretty simple to get up and going. You simply take it out of the box, you plug it in, and that's it. You follow the setup instructions on the screen, and it's pretty straightforward. It'll also go through a few other things. Uh, obviously, it's gonna tie into your Amazon account to be the most effective. But also, it's a full swivel screen on this uh, new Echo Show. So it'll actually set up where the screen swivels. It'll even ask you to uh, position it for the best screen uh, area where you want it. Maybe you've got in the kitchen, the family room. You can set that up uh, quite easily. Once it's done, that's where the fun starts. So this is an Amazon Echo Show. You can do all the traditional things uh, with it that you've been able to do in the past. So for example, I can give it all my Alexa commands. Uh, I can play music with this. It's got two tweeters and a woofer. It does really well with the music. I also like that it has built-in media capabilities as well. You can go into the video, for example, try that again, and you've got all the different types of streaming services that are available as well. See, it's actually following me here. Uh, so we've got Prime Video, Netflix, Hulu, YouTube. Uh, again, it's not the native YouTube app. It's got to go through the web. They're not playing well with Google yet, but maybe one day they uh, will. Uh, but I like it. It's pretty responsive. I can basically click in and uh, it loads up Netflix uh, really quickly. I like the interface on it as well. You can choose between all the different accounts that you have and uh, you can see you can watch uh, some of your shows while you're uh, making dinner. And the nice thing is because it's on the swivel screen, as I'm moving around, it follows me, which is kind of cool. Another thing I like about this uh, device is that the screen actually pivots. If you've ever seen the uh, Nest Hub Max, it's super cool too, but you're kind of stuck where the screen is. With this one here, you can move it up and down. And I do like the fact that the swivels, and it pretty well does it 360 degrees, which is uh, kind of uh, cool. This has got uh, a built-in 13 megapixel camera, so you can uh, do it uh, or use it for video calling. And the nice thing is you can phone other Alexa devices, especially the show devices or the Alexa app if someone's got that on their smartphone. Alexa, call John Beeler on his Alexa. Calling John Beeler's Alexa devices. So this is kind of a neat thing. It, uh, it will actually follow me wherever I'm going, which is kind of neat and, and weird at the same time, but it's, it's, it's cool. Oh, look, that was quick. Hey, John, can you hear me? Yeah, hello. I had to stick John in the backyard, <laughs> but he likes that. So John, I'm just showing them how I can have it follow me here. Um, and it doesn't work all the time. I'm, I'm sure that I'll have to work some of the kinks out here, but if it doesn't, I just say, Alexa, over here. And then it finds me. So I can actually go all the way around here. Alexa, over here. Bam, and there it goes. So I'm gonna have it, to, I'm gonna tilt the screen up so it can see me, my face better. So I'm just gonna keep moving here. And as I'm walking around, so you, as you can imagine, if you were like making dinner uh, at home in the kitchen, you can be going all over the place and still carry on that uh, conversation. What are you, you're on an iPhone, right, John? That's right. Yeah. And it answered pretty quickly? Very quickly, yeah. Very cool. You sound great. Yeah? Can't hear any background noise? No, it just sounds like a normal call. Very cool. Okay, we'll let you go. So some people are concerned about the, uh, the camera. They don't always want that on. The nice thing about the, uh, the Amazon Echo Show here is that it actually has a physical camera cover switch. So you can basically just switch that and now it's completely covered. It'll also give you a notification to let you know that's uh, happened. And if you wanna be completely Alexa free, you can also hit the mute button up top uh, as well. So uh, that's nice. Uh, again, if you just want that extra bit of privacy, maybe you just want to watch some shows uh, or read some recipes on there, 
you can do that. We're looking forward to actually uh, putting this through its paces, even comparing it to some of the others out there, like the Google uh, Nest uh, Hub Max, just to see how that uh, compares. But uh, out of the gate, I'm pretty impressed. The speaker seems uh, really nice. It's a large screen, I like it. It's very responsive, and the video calling features work quite well. Hey, this video is brought to you by you, our subscribers. And if you haven't subscribed yet, do it. It helps us make even more videos. We love doing them and we've got a lot more great ideas. And if you have some too, leave it down in the comment section below. Nice. Come on in.